Hello everyone, my name is Squidhead Joe, and this one's going to be a quick one, TLDR, if you want to buy this item, let's say you're in Walmart and you're looking up a quick review, um, the Mercury Innovations Jellyfish Lamp um, LED light, there's been a lot of these, I would say, online and everything like that, so you can pick them up anywhere, um, I'll put the price on screen for anybody who's not at Walmart and just looking up stuff, um, but for the price, I think this thing is okay, um, there's certain things that you have to follow in the manual, wherever it's very self-explanatory. Um, I'll show some B-roll right now of the lamp or whatever set up. I will just say that it says to use uh, purified water, so bottled water, filtered water, something like that. Do not use tap water. And I would strictly follow that because if something like this is telling you to do that, it's mostly because there's stuff inside tap water and everybody's tap water or wherever, whether you believe people put it in or not. Um, that will just make this thing really gunky and it's already kind of hard to get inside and clean I would say from the top um, if you buy the item you'll know what I'm talking about um, because the hole is really small you have to use the spoon that's given uh, in the package or something that's long like a stick or something um, in order to you know get in there and really clean uh, so don't use tap water so you don't have to clean it really um, you're going to put a couple drops of, uh, I would say dish soap or laundry detergent or something like that. It says detergent period. Um, so go ahead and do that, but make sure it's not this, anything that's super concentrated. I made that mistake and now mine is a little bit cloudy because of how concentrated the Dawn dish soap that I put in there is. I put two and I would say about a half of drops or wherever, um, just because, you know, lifting the bottle back up, it kind of you know dripped out or wherever a little bit more um so just be very careful about that and also filling it all the way up to the top yes there's no fill line or wherever so you can fill it up how high you want it to go and everything but i would say you know just don't fill it to the tippy tippy top give yourself some room because once you put the two lids that are come that come with it or wherever back on it's going to raise the water level because of air compression and all it's just no just don't fill it all the way to the top but overall, I'm really impressed with this product. The only thing I would say is that also that concentrating and making it a little bit cloudy wherever in there. Um, I kind of wish if they went the route of being very detailed and telling you not to use tap water to tell you not to use concentrated thing or whatever. But that's probably my fault on that. Um, and I would also say the jellyfish, I kind of wish there was four of them. Um, even on the box, you kind of see that there's like maybe two blues right there and two pinks. Um, it's just one of each. That's all. It's just, and it says it on the side of wherever two silicone uh, jellyfishes. But um, if you can find something else that's silicone or something like that that can fit inside the tube at the top or wherever, you can put more obviously stuff in there. Um, I would suggest doing that because most of the time they just float at the top. They barely move around or wherever. It could be because of the concentrated, like I said, dish soap I put in there um, and everything like that. They have a spoon, like I was showing in the unboxing, that you can, you know, move around or wherever get rid of the air bubbles and stuff and that's pretty much what i did and they were floating around and then they just got to the top and now they're just stuck at the top so i mean it is what it is the rgb is pretty nice um it visually or wherever it's bright enough i would say even just looking at it um you'll probably tell on camera or wherever it looks good so just overall i think a really good buy a solid buy um for something you know that's pretty cheap i would say overall um, and you just want something a little cool, a little desk item sitting on a shelf or something like that, leave it plugged in. Um, no problems or issues with it. Actually, a really, I would say, golden nugget if this is something that you're looking for um, to just take up some space or something like that. With that being said, my name has been Squidhead Joe. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Take care. Have a squid day. God bless you and yours. And deuces, everybody. Much love.